Let me say I am concerned of the manner that the former Prime Minister has delivered the, the statements that he has delivered. I think he's done three, particularly the last one. At this moment, I would like to consider them as a nuisance. I don't put waiting to read because uh, he's behaving as if he is still the Prime Minister. And um, <clears throat> there are definitely serious allegations that I'm making, which in my view right now are not true and completely unjustified. We have to look through them all, and our team is looking at that. And we want to assure the people that none of what the Prime Minister is saying is evident whatsoever. The police are not coming up with any reports. I'm waiting for the police commissioner to tell me anything. You know, I respect that. Not just the special branch report. The commander showed me today, you know, that everything is nothing for the people to hear. And may I just also say, if people are going to them, the government is here. We are not, you know, the government. We don't behave like the old government. We have everybody. So as I've said today, and assure the people, you know, if they want anything, if they are concerned about anything, if there is anything at all, the protection of their rights is important to us, and we are here to follow the law. And I've said that from the beginning. So, if anything, I would urge the former Prime Minister to please to refrain from such statements. But in due course, officially of course, because he has come out as leader of the opposition to say something, we would have to respond to that. 